out here in, in the waste area, or what people would call, consider a waste area, a, a woodlot in Oman, Muscat. And we're just looking around at all the tracks and sign, and also some of the trees and plants around, uh, and other plants around. Um, we found a few tracks here, and I'm just going to point out a few of them, just for interest's sake. What we have right in front here, in the foreground, is a set of tracks of a beetle. It's a Libra and a beetle, or darkling beetle. Um, these are beetles that are typically uh, found in this area. They have very long legs. They are also um, designed to, to hold a lot of, or to maintain their water content or their moisture by having their wings fused together so they can't fly. Um, so this is typical tracks for a tenebrionid beetle. Just a bit to the right here, or your left, you'll see these tracks. Um, there's one, two, three, four points. Those are rodent tracks. Um, that's actually a hopping track. Um, the rodent lands with its two forelegs and the, ho the back legs come around and land like that in front of the forelegs. So it's moving in that direction. Um, right next to me, we have an interesting bush. This is called Salvadora persica. It's called the toothbrush bush because the roots can actually be used to make a toothbrush. And what you would do is you would actually dig up the roots, uh, which I'm not going to do right now, but you dig up the roots and you chew them so that you have a brush-like uh, tip and, and that you can use to clean your teeth and gums. Um, it also has antibacterial properties which help. Um, it does have an edible berry too, which is red in color. Um, there are a lot of useful plants around. There are a lot of acacias here, uh, which are very, very uh, thorny, spiny trees. Um, they make good firewood. Some acacias have edible gums. Um, some don't, of course. And they're very, very high in nitrogen content, which is really good for livestock if you have livestock. Um, animals like to chew acacia trees, hence the thorns which protect them from um, herbivores because um, obviously herb herbivores want to graze or browse on them. Um, there are a lot of other trees here. One of the most predominant trees is um, unfortunately an introduced tree, which is uh, Prosopis juliflora, which is a mesquite species and um, it has grown out of control in many parts of the Arabian Peninsula and uh, not the best tree to have around. 